colors. All right, hello everybody. Um, we are here to commentate this awesome bingo match between um, Team Final Rush and Team Seven. Um, this is going to be a very exciting match here. Um, I'm yeah. here joined with Melters. Uh, yeah, Divu, I'm I'm so glad to be commentating with you right now. Yes, this is going to be very very cool. Um, yeah, not uh, we've had a lot a lot of bingo today, lots of crazy matches, oh, upsets, yeah. and long matches. So oh. I can only imagine that we're going to get more. Right. So let's go ahead and give a bit of a background here on these runners. Um, it, it, it really is a sort of David and Goliath sort of situation here. Like Piner and Lexi are two veterans of the game, extremely consistent in what they do, and are just going into this thing very confident that they'll at minimum get top three in the league. Um, on the same token, Baluk and Box have been learning so much during these um, few um, weeks, few months here during Bingo. And if they if they lose any more matches, it's going to be really tough for them to um, have an opportunity to get into the top six for a possible, um, basically for the Bingo League, um, supposing that happens. So um, what do you think about these runners going in? Give me your sort of analysis and what to expect here, Devo. Again, I think you really uh, hit the nail on the head. It is really a David versus Goliath here. Um, Piner and Lexi are both top runners of the game. Um, and uh, Blug and uh, Box are probably more like, I would say, like mid to high to high runners. So um, it's definitely um, going to be uh, very much up to decision making here, like with these goals. So um, whichever runners can keep their cool and make good decisions are going to end up on top here. I think so too. And uh, walk me through a few of the dark goals here as well. Yeah, so um, we saw Lexi practicing the alternate mock bounce uh, earlier. Um, that's because we have a Shadow Flame Ring, um, which is in Radical Highway. And you can do a very cool mock bounce from the bottom to grab that fast. Um, we have a pretty... there's The story progression goals are going to be pretty intense right off the bat because you pretty much have like Flame Ring and then you have two Egg Quarters that can all happen in story like all at the same time. So it's going to be pretty huge for whichever runners ahead entering radical highway yeah I, I like i really agree with those as well like you got security hall you've got um all these other missions including headquarters um you've got a lot of killers as well you've got like cosmic wall with all seven checkpoints that's like a yeah, minimum, that... at minimum a four minute time four minute yeah. next time sync yeah and and like that's I don't see anybody going for that unless uh, it's like end game and where it's going to 180, not 180, uh, 80 emblems. Yeah. Oh my god. Going to a 180. Could you imagine? Yo, chow races. Hold up. Anyways, <laughs> but yeah, on the hero side of things, it's fairly standard fare. You've got a lot of like early missions. Um, I, well, actually, let me let me take that back. You don't have a lot of early missions. The soonest you're gonna find is Metal Harbor with the um, with the upper handle, which is um not the hardest thing in the world. But then it really skips like Tails' Mystic Melody, which is technically linear. You got Wild Canyon, which is before that, and it's sort of spread into Eternal Engine, and it, it's not like someone's gonna run away with like story progression like in in a race like this. Because there are so many M2s, we're talking about that Devo, right? Yeah, exactly. Because you're going to be able to just snag a ton of these M2s fast um, right. when you're doing missions. So it's like, let's say like, uh, like let's say like Piner and Lexia end up like very far ahead, mm -hmm. and uh, Blug and Box end up uh, grabbing all these M2s really fast. It could really mean uh, be a huge swing back. So. And uh, I, I just want to mention something as well. We're seeing this um this skull here, Death Chamber Chamber M four B rank. Um, this is a crazy mission. Let me just put it that way, because you have to be very precise. Look at that. It's and this very is exactly, hard to get. This is exactly why Blue is practicing it before the match. Speaking of practicing, it looks like we're going to be getting um 
getting on a roll here in a few minutes. Um, we're really going to be looking at this Wild Canyon M1 hit list. It is all going to be RNG, basically. Um, very tough to... Oh, by the way, shout out to the Secretary team theme for Piner. That's that's how you win. That's how you win. That's how everybody wins. Absolutely you put, cursed. You got to put that um thing on next time as we're getting underway here. Um, what what also is going to matter a whole lot is C skip. Um, as long as nothing terrible happens to box um in in this level, it shouldn't be that bad in Iron Gate. Um, neither going for Ethmar jump, but. Piner already a little bit, um, a little bit behind, but let's, what kind of music am I listening to? Do you recognize this? Anyways, um, <laughs> this is Drift Fuel City from Pokemon. Um, but unlike Pokemon, we're not going to catch all of these goals. We're only going to find a few of them, I guess. So going into City Escape Skip, what are we going to find? This is your right, time to let's see. Let's see. Okay, on a little and, late. Oh, uh -huh. no. And let's see what Piner goes. And Piner's looking clean and does Piner. not also does the not get rare it. miss. And Piner Piner's goes, going okay. for second so, try. So Piner does this, by the way. Very old school runner in which um Wait, would Piner's go going this all time. the way back up. Um hmm, this is so interesting, actually. Yeah, most people when they do second try, they just um okay. oh, there we go. So this, again, this is the Piner special right now. Um, Piner is known for doing this um, during RTA, like, get to the end runs. And it's kind of working out. So uh, it's really, really cool that Piner is bringing down old school strats right now, knowing that it's exactly worth it. And is actually going to be ahead, despite all this going on. It's yeah, that's crazy. Move. Yeah, that's, that is very impressive. And to do that under pressure like that, I can only yeah. imagine. Um... Yeah, right? Because CE skip's not exactly an easy trick to do, and uh, especially if you're getting like flustered after missing it f the first time, and then kind of getting a little bit of spaghetti after that. Yeah, and I mean, imagine being ahead. This really just goes to show Piner's... Like, Piner is, is, is a bit of a paragon of a gamer, I must say. Not to rub him on his back too much, but in Smash and SA2, whatever he touches, he's just like crazy at. So All right, so we, so we have about less than a second... Uh, between Lexi and Box right now as well, so so that's a pretty decent Iron Gates from both of them. Right, and hmm, Bo let me Box see. is so, actually ahead IGT. Yeah, IGT, and they're also in America, so um, <laughs> she, she's also in America, so that's pretty cool as well. Maybe not the right team, though. However, um, I really think, like, you know what it is? The, the RNG in in Dry Lagoon, even if even though there's no goals in there necessarily, kind of sets the stage for the entire run as well. Because with runners at these levels, you kind of expect like to be synced here. But what are we gonna? What do you think we're gonna see here? Um, so Dry, Dry Lagoon is really gonna decide. Dry Lagoon and Sand Ocean are really gonna decide the early swing of this game. Because our first story for Veteran Goal is in Radical Highway, and uh, it's just gonna be huge for whichever runner gets out of Sand Ocean first. Lexi you know what I'm realizing? Cool strats here, right? And so here's what here's I agree with what Lexi's doing. By the way, um, Lexi is just taking a bad set, which is kind of like what you want to do because you want as many lives as you can get into Sand Ocean. So I agree with this entirely. Me, yeah, it's, Piner, it's go ahead. It, it's an understandable play. I mean, I got totally rolled by uh, resetting for Mad Space in my match. And uh, I should have just taken a bad set. Box right. is Box. exiting first, though. Box. Now, I think Box got hints, though. You, okay, Maybe I think I know what Box is... I, I think I know what Box is doing, though. Um, oh, wait, there, it, it's the wrong mission. The Wild right? Canyon's hit list. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Wait, I'm... I'm uh... However, like, they're really synced, and Box is actually ahead right now. Um, Lexi is, again, a a like master of consistency in sand ocean especially like the sand walking so we're gonna see what's gonna happen here but piner definitely pulling ahead that c skip really did make the difference um diva yeah so box has really been practicing her sand walking so if she can hit this first try this is gonna be huge for her 
Um, let's see how it goes. First attempt, first try. Let's go, Glox. Okay. So first try. Meanwhile, Lexi is faltering a little bit. Yeah, so um, Lexi's going to have to catch up here. Uh, she does bot boost, so if we see the... Oh, wait. I was, that... that wasn't going to make it. Yeah, that I think that was uh, one frame late. And by the way, I think we're going to be seeing a role reversal. This is this is a little bit uncharacteristic, but you can't blame Lexi. Sand Ocean is Sand Ocean, no matter who you are, Devo. Yeah, I mean, sand walking, no matter how good. Oh, no. Please oh, tell me Box no. is low enough. Why does no. this always happen to her? Oh, that is not fair at all. Like, oh, my God. She gets first try sand walking and then gets totally And now rolled. she has to go to the leaderboards and find KD4. Oh, uh, and watch the and watch the cutscene again, too. Both of them are just, like, really struggling right. here in sand like, ocean. This is, why, this is why I don't go for this in races, like... Just absolutely rolled. Just uh, totally unfair. And Le Lexi doesn't fail it this many times. No, not normally. You do not like to see this. I wonder at what point are we just going to no. see first cycle. Here's yeah, yeah Box, Box is biting the bullet. She is still kind of on cycle, but it's going to be pretty tough. Um, yeah, Lexi I, I... is still going for it. Oh my god, wow. This is an absolute meltdown right now. You have to commend her mental fortitude for uh, attempting uh, it this many times. Oh, wow. This is very uncharacteristic. Now, here's the thing, though. Box is solidly on second cycle, so that's about a 213. Just about. So she's not going to be that much behind, like, all things considered. But it's still not an ideal. You still want to be saving some time. For yeah, example, so right? Go ahead. So if Lexi gets this right now, then I don't think that Lexi's going to be that far behind. And she did get it, so... Yeah, it's... You know what's interesting? Both runners are going to have information, and I think that sort of gives their mental like, right? Like, they're not going to see this egg quarters thing, like, checked off for a while, and they're going to be like, what's going on here, right? It's like, the... The Radical Highway goal is the first one, so that's going to be where yeah, the, they, they know where the they're at. Ring. So, yeah. so here's what I think is going to happen. Box, it, I really hope you don't die here. Oh my god, my, my heart's about to beat out of my chest, Diva. Oh I know, god. this is, I mean, no this melters. is like... No melters. No, no melters. melters, no. No melters, no. Okay, okay. This is what it, this is what we say. Melters, no melters. All right. By the way, Piner has a little bit of a lead here in in the in this stage in the hero story in general so i think that he's they're definitely going to um catch that for sure but could you like, could you imagine how far uh box would be in the head ahead right now if the robot didn't rule her this is unbelievable yeah. but but here's the thing like box is definitely gonna go for this goal and she's gonna be like oh my god i got this goal what's going on on the other side why the heck am i getting this and i think it's gonna put some wind in her sails depot. What do you yeah, think? Yeah, I agree. Wind under your sails? It definitely would. I think that it, like when Box grabs the flame wing first, which I don't see any reason why she shouldn't at this point. Um, yeah. Because there's not a lot that can go wrong um, at the beginning of Radical Highway. Um, you can... Uh, I think Box is going to be like, wow, I got to play. I got to get to headquarters because headquarters is like the next really big like dark pool because you can grab two in, at once pretty much. Oh my god, Piner! <laughs> All right, and Piner just barely makes it. No, well, here's oh, the thing. Blug. Here's the thing. Bloog dies, but it's not that big of a deal because she wasn't gonna get it anyways. However, um, Box, Box, I, I need you to get this goal because if you do, you're gonna realize uh -huh. how. Okay. All right, but, and she, but... she gets it. She gets it. Yeah. So it's gonna be one two here. However, um, Bloog is still behind in story. And here's the thing, they're going to be pretty much tied up here. Um, look at right, this. Le Part Lexi sees it bounce. pretty much, yeah, she does the mock bounce. So now Lexi's going to be ahead of, uh, like, they're pretty much tied up in Radical High. They, they right are now. neck and neck, and I think the RNG and just the who is the better hunter um, going into headquarters is really going to make a difference here. And to be honest with you, um, Red Honda... Uh, Red Honda works for... I don't know if Lexi did Red Honda, but Box no. did not uh, that, went for no, it. She, she's old school. She don't go for that. She she got a Honda Civic. Don't worry about it. Anyways, <laughs> so so Lexi is is squarely ahead right now. 
I, it, it's really going to depend oh, on our team. Oh, the rail. Rare miss. This is oh, going to be about a 10 seconds of time loss. This is exactly what Box needs right now. Yeah, this is... Wait a oh, second. Okay. Box, Box misses the rail. Box misses the rail. They're, they're tied up again. Oh, my Look God. The yeah, they're like neck and neck. Oh, my gosh. My heart. Will we see any gap jumps from Lexi? I know Lexi knows how to do it. Um, yeah. I mean, if I'm Lexi and what happened to me happened, I'm... Uh, I am not going for gap jump, but I feel uh, like I would, but nope, we're not seeing it. Okay, so both Ryan. I know are... Devo, Devo. I know you. I know you, <laughs> Devo. You don't, you don't, you don't got to tell me. However, what I got to tell you is that Lexi is definitely going to be ahead right now, losing a little bit of time. RTA is box, but um, still hmm. so close though. RNG is going to be such a huge factor in these headquarters missions. Right. I mean, and it, you kind of think to yourself, like, Box Box might think she's still ahead. I don't know if, if you're I don't Box, know, because with what ahead. happened, I don't know. Box had... Yeah, it is hard to say. Because you know you're going against Lexi, who can get sub-140 times in Radical Highway. I, it's, it's hard to say what Box's mentality is right now. I mean, what I, if I were Box, like, I would go for one of the goals, right? Like, choose one and hope that Lexi's not going for the other one. If anything, I'm going for hit list because of what happened. But if you're Lexi, what do you do? I This is so interesting. I think you're right. There's a lot of big brain plays here with only going for one of these goals. Because you can just I, grab that one goal before the the other person grabs both. Right. Oh, However, wait. Both Lexi them, just grabbed a hint. Yeah, both of them are going for it. No, no, no. Box is not going for hits anymore. Yeah. Box is not no longer going for hits. Yeah, getting these free piece checks. Very smart. Um... All right, seems to get um, seems to get an upgrade room piece. So here's, this is Yin and Yang right here, by the way. So Lexi's going for the two Chow boxes. Box and is going box for is hitless. Going hitless. Yeah. This is so cool. Um, wait a second. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's it's two beautiful women with fish faces. What are you doing? Now get out of there, box. Or it's. No, it's I think it is. I think it is beautiful. Faces. Faces. Yeah, I think it is also. No, Box, go back. Box, you're getting cracked, RNG, and you don't even know it. Oh, Box, oh, Box. Box, no, no it's, it's not King and Fish Surfer. ladies, it's fish ladies. Box, I know it's hard to believe, buddy, but you got a really cracked set right now. And you're oh green. Box doesn't know, and this is costing her a lot of time. Like, Box, if if Box knew, Box, you get count. Yeah, Box is going aquatic right now, but. Like, fish lady, it's fish lady. above the rocket, above the rocket. Box is there, breaking there, down right now. There you go, yeah, there you go. Okay, okay. I mean, it, it's it's a bit of a silver lining. You know exactly where box. Oh, and she grabbed a hint. Oh man, she's grabbing another hint. Why are you grabbing a hint box? There we go. Okay. Oh, it's shoot. it's it's the autopilot. Like I think that tilted her so much. She's not even checking the free pieces anymore. And I mean. That that is such a huge breakdown, especially what happened like right now it's one three. Going for the wrong piece. The piece is right there on the screen, but she's not going for it. Oh this is not what you want to see, Devo. Okay, so what are we looking at in Hero Story here? Let's move let's let's uh shift our gears. We've been talking about Dark Story for a lot for a long time now. Um, so I, we're we're looking for the Tales of Mystic Melody, Death Chamber, and One Hillless, and then we're going into could go into missions as well. But those are the two linear ones. I think that's what Piner's going for. So that's why we're talking about Dark here because they have some really big moments here. Um, yeah, but Fox will secure this goal even if it's happening slowly. Um, right so for Box. It's gonna be two three and. It's just so tough because now Box is going to be almost a whole stage behind Lexi. And it really didn't have to be that way. Like, it really goes no. to show, like, when, like, hunting, it mattered. Hunting, like, you have to know everything about hunting for Hitless, right? You yeah, can't just it... know some things. You have to be, know exactly what kind of pieces, like, like, for example, Box doesn't know that this piece is not a piece three and that it can't spawn here. Um, I believe this is, um... I think this is under uh, the belly. Um, yeah, no, no. I think it's the water. Above, slowly, above the, slow, I think it's. I think it's in the water. I think it's slowly float, swimming, floating in the stream. Floating this in the is stream. It, right? yeah, yeah. Like, this is this is a bit of a wake up call. Maybe a wake up call for Box. Like, yeah. 
Uh, you know what? I don't think Box like grinds this grinds non story style enough and wouldn't know this. Look yeah, I mean you, how... you you don't you don't get these P, you don't get these like P uh, blue room P threes unless you play NG plus. So yep. So right, if you're Lexi and you just see this goal clicked off right now, like you know that both of you are, are eating a big bowl of spaghetti right now, but at least you have a smaller portion basically. Oh, Piner grabbed uh Piner grabbed a pumpkin hill uh M two so. Yeah. Piner is in uh, hmm. missions right now. You know what? Um, I think that like Pine this is a good idea from Piner. It's it's two four right now, and Lexi's lined up to get even more goals. The only problem is I don't think Piner thinks oh, he's go, as ahead in. of uh, Piner's right. trying to full blue. <laughs> right. I think Piner thinks he's more ahead than they think they are, right? Yeah, I think so too. Because blue, all right, forget what I said, but blue gum loses zero cycle. Piner's not on pace for it either. Um, both of them are like lined up for half cycle at the very least. Lexi is going for missions, and that's a smart idea. Actually, yeah, I agree. I agree going, with the call as well. Here's the thing, <laughs> it's so funny. Lexi's like, Sand Ocean, I am going to kick your butt right now. You're gonna be my gonna be my punching bag this is not happening to me right now i am lexi i am lexi cohen with the lexi you don't get to treat me this way i'm gonna win either way no matter what happens the good news is i mean box is getting like a good amount of heroes of dark story progress right yeah box Box could definitely put herself like pretty far ahead and uh we have uh pacifist white jungle which is pretty far forward but um you could also get more uh, options you, get, you, you can get you can get weapons bed m2 if you get into weapons bed mm. um but i think lexi we're probably gonna see her do this i think we're gonna see her do um headquarters we're gonna see her do the headquarters m3 and uh i feel like there was one more earlier oh radical highway m2 so i think we're gonna see lexi try to do all these goals and then jump back into story so here's the crucial thing, like that's a really good point, and uh, piggybacking on that, what's really going to make a huge difference here is this Tales' is Mystic Melody. I'm not sure if you know about this um, clip in particular in Hero, but it can be tough if you don't know how to do it. Technically it is linear, like Rouge's Mystic Melody. We're going to- Blue's going to be put to the test right now, will she be able to do this? Uh, oh yes, um, for Tales Mystic Melody. Yeah, you have to clip it in a weird way. In our match, uh, Seahawks had the same goal and uh, had a lot of trouble. Uh, oh yeah, doing the clip. So um, it is not an easy clip to do. But I mean, it's all about the practice. It is consistent, but it's like it's like CGSS, right? You have to know the out of bounds movement and like know how to do it. But Luke is getting really good RNG. Well, was getting really good RNG until that happened. So I think she's going to be pretty good going in here. If Piner can get some really good RNG, that can make a huge difference right now. Getting the main pillar! Oh, misses the free piece. Sad. You going, hate into we going into weapons bed is le is box. I think she knows. Like, right, if you're box, like, you're going for linear. There's no shot you're going, like, for freaking weapons by M2 or anything. You've got to, like, make up some ground because you know Lexi's ahead of you, right? If I was Box, yeah, I think that is the play, but I don't know. The, there are so many early Dark Wolves, it would mm. be, like, kind of a shame. Mm. Um, but, I, but if I was Box, I might exit out and do weapons by M2 because then that kind of, like, locks like Lexi away from... Because I don't even think Lexi has weapons by completed, correct? She like, does Lexi not. Exit. Yeah, so... Mm hmm so, so yeah, I don't know. Good, it's, that's it's, a good idea. I, I think even that's Radical a good Highway idea. M2 could be... Oh, no, she's doing it right now. Okay. So, I mean, if you're boxing... Like, you're not quitting out of weapons bed after you, like... You're halfway through the level, for sure. But that gives you good information, and they're definitely not out of this thing, Devo, I don't think. Yeah, I think you're right, actually. I think Box's play is to actually go through the story, maybe even all the way to White Jungle. Right, um, I think so, too, because... Like get go to White Jungle, get the Chow Key so you don't have to go through the Faker cutscene, and then yeah. perhaps go for White Jungle M4, go for 
egg quarters, go for weapons bed. Like, the world is your oyster, but it really depends on when Box wants to go out. Box doesn't have a lot of height here, so I'm a bit concerned, but she should be able to make it. Okay, ooh, that was looks, close. She looks good, but it was close. That was really close. I was I was very concerned. I'll plex um, again for the cool uh, M2 strat. She gets it. Still has uh, to pick up one ring off. Rings. Yeah, you just grabbed it right up here. Well, many rings off, actually, but um, that's that's two six right now. This is really slipping away. Bloog's only saving grace right now is that that she is ahead of Piner, but that's not even like a great thing to think about because how long are you going to be in, in, ahead of Piner, right? It's it's really tough. Well, that's what that's what's hard about going against these top runners like Lexi and Piner, because yeah. um, it's like sure you can get ahead of them at one point, but like the two or three seconds that they're saving on you per stage like adds up really fast because just from like execution from like top runners and stuff like that i um, agree with you the other thing is so lexi is indeed going to go for egg quarters on three which is very very quick like it, it is it is unbelievable how quick that is the box's only salvation right now is that she has a lot more progress in the story but is that enough to bring this one back because a lot to be honest we're running out of dark goals and I well yeah i mean like the ones that lexi are picking up right now are really most of the goals so it is really mm. hard to to say but i do mm. think it's smart for box to be doing this because mm. unless she could like read minds it, it would be hard to know which goals lexi was going for in the right. order that lexi's doing them in and something i wanted to bring up as well like box um what did i want to bring up i forgot Box has Cosmic Wall, technically. Box, you know what, I think after this, Lexi's gonna do the 25 lives thing, actually, but... Box has White Jungle, Cosmic Wall, and those missions, like, down pat, basically, without any, like, competition, really. So, going for taking a nap there. Oh, taking a Death Strat. Getting Let's a 57. Is off. Yeah, I think... You can see, yeah, okay, is, that's this, a fine this is, this is really good, but I mean... It's just these hunting levels. I think Box is definitely going to take this to the bank and grind those out just like he was doing sand walking, don't you think? Yeah, I think so too. I think we see that. Oh, Lexi getting the really quick grab for uh, um, yeah, we, Headquarters we are, M3. We are part of the sub-15 gang in this in this neighborhood. Um, that's 3-7. Like, we do get another goal. Oh, Bloog is coming up here to the... Um, Two chat box and security on finish, so she does get that linear goal. Huh, so Lexi goes into weapons bed. Do you think she's gonna go? Hold on. But first we need to see this. Like, this is gonna decide a lot. Blue has a yeah. couple, maybe has one or two tries. She has to get this perfectly. Like, look at how hard this is. It's a it's extremely difficult, uh... Yeah, no. Off. No. Yeah. No, 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 no. So they're tied right now, and, um... Bloog has one shot at this, but if she messes this up, Piner was grinding this before and, and they got it like pretty consistently. I don't know. This could be really bad and if Bloog, like it's really gonna sting and we'll put the nail in the coffin if Bloog does not get this right now. And I, I, I don't know Piner. Piner, they call you Piner Devo. Yes. Yeah, I mean, it depends on what Piner's consistency with this clip is as well. Um. Wait a second, but, uh, Piner. Piner's not even going for it. Yeah, Piner's just taking the story down. Mm. Interesting. This is... No, no, he's going back. They're going back. I'm sorry. But... Piner's... Yeah, uh, Piner, uh, like, I would be very surprised if Piner messes this up. Like, Piner doesn't mess this up. Yeah, well, we're going to see it. Um, Piner is clipping in yeah. right now. Clipper yeah, Piner. Is in. Yep, there it Piner is. Does not, okay. Piner does. Piner takes these. <laughs> oh man! All right. Well, there goes. Uh, oh, by the way, advantage. did you see what Piner just did? No. Oh my god! Oh my god! Piner got the checkpoint, got the upgrade, and died. So that there. Uh, oh, that's why he went ahead. I mean, they went ahead. Oh my god! Piner's, Piner is mega mind. Piner yeah, is a wow. genius. Oh my god. 
Yeah, oh that was God, a Mega Piner. Mind play. Was it, what, I, was, what was I saying before? Piner being a paragon of gaming? Yeah, I think we're seeing this on full display. That was a genius move. Oh my yeah. God, Piner. All right. All right, so Box needs to not kill this spiky boy, which is harder than it sounds. All right, Box is getting through. Oh my god, did you see that? No, I, I did not. That, that spiky boy just, like, rammed into the other guy. <laughs> all right, well, Box didn't do it, at least. All right, so, all right. yeah, and I mean, this is going to be really tough. Like, Bloog had a chance, but... Uh, yeah, know, Blue like, not I getting hate... that goal hurts. That hurts their team a lot. Like because, I hate to uh... say it, but yeah. All right, so we got passive white jungle, and like it's like, what's the play here? Is you know, is it for Blue to exit and do the weapons bed M two? I think it might be. I think if Blue does weapons bed M two really quick right now, mm -hmm. um, but I don't know because she has the story advantage for Cosmic Wall. But I uh, guess that's so. Seven check. That's so long. That that's a long goal. I I agree with you. I think I think she should, but also I don't know. Like this this makes sense in a vacuum, right? Because you kind of she's kind of assuming that Lexi is trying to beat her to this cosmic wild goal, I guess. But I don't know. This it's it's a bit of a coin flip. The only thing I was saying, like. It, it hurts to say, but like Blue and Box, if their execution right, was just a little bit exit. better. Yeah, going through the Faker cutscene, mind you. So that's a lot of time. Uh, yeah, what is that's that? A like lot 40 of time. seconds. Right. So not getting the Chow key, Tethys strats as it as they call it. So let me think. I mean, I don't. So on the surface, what what Blue and Box are doing seems like the right choice, but it's. It really is just sealing their doom right now. They're, they're in a bad spot either way, Devo. Yeah, I agree. It's it's not a very easy position to be in. I think um, that, yeah. Especially because like getting to White Jungle M four A rank, like that's going to take a while to do because you pretty much have to play all of White Jungle to get M three. Yeah. Um, you know what it is like. And I mean, I hate to say this as um, Piner is getting through prison lane here. Like, when something happens, like, that's really bad during these things, like, you gotta keep a really cool and sort of just just sort of take it at face value, right? And I think these runners may, uh, I don't know. I don't know what to say, but getting this B rank is Blue. Uh, just to clarify something, uh, the enemy did kill the other enemy in Box's White Jungle. Uh, yeah. Box did not kill the enemy, so the goal is still valid. Just so yep. everybody knows. Um, yeah, as long as you're the pacifist, that's all that matters. I found okay, so weapons bed. I if mean, the robots Box... choose violence, that's on them. Yeah, so Box right now... This is really, really interesting what box is going for because here's the thing you could get these 25 lives with with your eyes closed right that's but, true you just have to go but, into sand ocean and do that but going for white jungle and lexi probably knows you're going for white jungle by the way what it, it, it's it's no 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 blue is going for the lives which is pretty smart but i mean you want to get to death chamber or eternal engine or something this this is pretty much like I, I can't like it seems close. It's seven eight, but it's it's seven eight up to a point, right, Devo? Yeah, like, in the in the long run, uh keeping this up the this play. The, keeping it up isn't gonna be easy. I mean well okay, well here's the thing. I mean Blue goes back into story sort of it, My it's God sort of like, box, that was so sketchy. Why did you do that? Did you see Box? She like practically landed on the robot. Oh yeah, I'd oh, be God, landed on the robot, Let me see. So I don't know. So here's the thing. Put yourself in Lexi's shoes right now. You got all these goals, they're catching up. Do you like do you go for Cosmic Wall and just Cosmic Wall, or do you figure that Box is already on her way to them? I don't know. It's rough. It, it's a I think that if Lexi goes for uh White Jungle right now and uh, Box can stay ahead of her all the way through the M4, then that's exactly what Box needs, is to just waste a ton of Lexi's time. 
Um, and that could be huge for her. I'm looking at Piner's. I agree with you, and I'm looking at Piner's screen, and I don't know where this piece is. I'm very stupid and confused. Much like Piner is. Is this heart? Oh, it's Hintless. I was gonna say, what's going on here? Oh my god, where is this piece at? Uh, is it... No. No, I know. It's heart. Did Piner just throw heart in a bingo? No, it's two containers. No, it's two gatekeepers? What the heck is going on? Does anybody in chat know what this piece is? Like, I feel like I'm- I'm the idiot. Oh, it's- <laughs> it's Big Marshmallow Doi. Oh. Uh, <laughs> the okay. literal- the literal only piece that it could be. I'm like, oh my god, this is a- Can't believe- I can't believe they rolled Scramble for the Skull, Smile. <laughs> but anyways, we're gonna get Connect the Dots right now. Nice and easy, but it- it took quite a lot of time for Piner to do that. I mean, if you're blue, right, you might think that Piner's, like, exiting out to do missions or something, but, uh, getting Gorilla's hideout. Uh-oh. Alright, so we got Death Chamber Hintless. Yeah, this is gonna be ten? No, it's gonna be nine. So, yeah. Here's the thing. Um, Piner, Piner and Lexi just win here. And, it, and I hate to say it. Um, all they have to do is go for Death Chamber, the Death Chamber missions, Chow Boxes, and Cosmic Wall, and... There's no way that they can make it back, really, realistically. Uh, does Box... I'm, I've never seen... Oh, no, I didn't know you could do it that way. Oh, nope. I, I wouldn't know. do it that way, but... Yeah, I was gonna say, I normally stand on the other tree and, uh, spin dash. I think it's like the... How, how, how do you say? So, like, here, you can tell... Like, I, I hate to say this, but you could tell how frazzled... Like, the... Final Rush is just frazzled because first Blue is doing missions, then she's going into missions, then she's going into story, then she's going into missions. She she does she seems kind of lost her answers here, Devo. Yeah, it seems like, and it, it's sad when that kind of stuff is going on because it's like you're losing right. a lot of RTA by just like mm -hmm. entering story and uh, exiting story and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, all right, so let's and see if Box does this. Which way? Like what? And mind you, I don't know if Box knows how to do this. Yeah, I just got to go from here, Piner. It's oh, okay. There we go. But, Never mind. She does. I, I want to point out to you that Blue and Piner are doing the same missions, and Piner is a 180 runner and has a big lead here. So, like Lexi was doing the right thing. Lexi, Luke was doing the right thing before, and we know she was doing the right thing before, but kind of just I don't even know what she's doing. Oh, she's going for M2 rings, but. Meanwhile, Pyre's an M3 Devo. Like, that's such a huge yeah. deficit. When Bluke sees this, like, clicked off, like, she's gonna she's gonna lose her mind. It's not gonna be good. I wouldn't want to be in her position. Yeah, I agree with that. Um, wait, no. Hidden base M2. Are you sure? No, Piner was an M2. Yeah, because... Yeah. Oh, there the, we go. Yeah, Bluke was just at the end of M2. Yeah. Yeah, this is 10 goals. It's pretty much game set and match because Piner can literally just go into story and like have yeah, fun. Yeah, and just and just and just get these late later uh, story goals. Yeah, again, got to think about the long term for sure here. Um, let me see. So yeah, Death Chamber M4 B rank. Oh, that that Piner can do that like the back of their head. But um, I think they're just gonna go for story, probably. I'd imagine. I think that it would be uh, definitely well, probably the play to do story. Going into Wild Canyon for what? To get the upgrade, maybe? But why do you need the upgrade? For Death Chamber M4. No, never mind. M2. No, M2. 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 Okay. Pretty interesting. Um, like That definitely makes it a lot easier. You still don't have the sunglasses, however, so it's still not going to be in the walk in the park, though. If I'm if I'm Piner, I'm doing uh. If I'm Piner, I'm doing back rig strats for sure. Oh man, I, I had this one very specific memory with Piner, and they taught me how to do this mission without um without any upgrades. It was pretty awesome that they taught that to me. But yeah, Lexi. Awesome. So here's the thing, right? Like you, you got to keep a straight head, and Lexi has the conviction to go to Cosmic Wall and just win, right? 
um, rather than sort of like moseying around and deciding what to do as as she goes along. So, like, just a very solid play for Piner and Lexi, despite what happened in Sand Ocean. Like, really not really undeterred, right, Devo? I agree. I mean, because it would be very easy to get tilted after a Sand Ocean like that. Yeah. Um, and just like play like badly for the rest of the time, but she's been playing really well. Um, yeah. I think that's box. Yep, and that is box getting the A rank for M four. So she takes that. Um, but like, what is the play for box now? Like, is it to? I guess it's to grab this twenty five lives mission. Um, go into right. Sand Ocean and do that. Um, but uh. Yeah, I but mean that's like, gonna be a pretty uh, quick grab, but, but you know what but they're after, doing. But right? after that, what's the play? You know what? Box, what's like the. Uh, sorry, sorry, dude. I I mean I totally agree with you. So, box is box is playing to get goals right now, and yeah, that's yeah. fair. But box and and final rush are not playing to win necessarily. Not not anything against them or anything. I'm just sort of pointing it out. Um, they're going to get as many goals as they can, sort of realizing that it may be out of their grasp. Does does wait a second? Yeah, Piner doesn't have the sunglasses. Oh yeah. Piner realizes that. that. Yeah, Piner just realized that they don't have the sunglasses. Anyways, but yeah, and I mean, you got to give it up. Um, I mean, they're playing really get... well. I mean, honestly, like the two of them, Box and Bluke, um, to get this many goals against a team like Lexi and Piner. I mean, that's that's pretty unbelievable. Um, is it, I got so it's it, it not being a wash at all. It's very awesome. I think it's yeah, yeah. I think um, Lug and Box are definitely gonna go to the um, drawing board after this and just sort of assess what what happened, what went wrong, what went right. Because Bo Blue and Box did do some really good things. I know. Again, um, I just think back on if if Box didn't get the robot killing itself in Sand Ocean, I just like I just like to think of like what the uh, what this match would look like right now. Right, because I mean. I, I hate to not talk about what's going on on screen, but like that's why, like, in order for that not to happen, you don't go for it, right? Yeah, it's true. Oh, and that's like, you kind of eliminate that bias. You may get a 150, but at the same time, if you fail sand walking once, you're breaking even anyway. So, so is it really worth it? Meanwhile, Piner's having a lot of trouble here. You're the one who taught me how to do this, Piner. So, you need one more ring. I had no idea how hard this uh, mission was. So let me think. There, there are a few rings over here. Um, so we, s this is really rare opportunity to point out that Piner went to a place like the the actual casual M M like Los Chow area, which you never see, like ever see, um, in a speed run. So that's pretty cool because they were just a lot low on rings. Meanwhile, so it's gonna come really close, right? Because Bloog is on track to get this, um... Bloog is on track to get this Green Forest M5A rank for sure, but it's not gonna be nearly enough. Like, they're gonna even up the goals, actually, but it's just too little too late here. Yeah, because the problem is, it's like, they're gonna get their 10 goals, but then, like, Piner and Lexi are just... I mean, P Lexi's already in Kha'Zix Wall, yeah. and, uh... That is the absolute death knell. Piner's gonna get this M4 for free, so... Can you imagine, like, this could go to 80 M1. Yeah, it definitely could. Which, again, if that if that's what happens... Yes. Um... Blugen Box might have a little bit... of an advantage here, just from them doing more missions. Right, um, I think so, too. But I don't Actually, know if it's gonna make it that far. I think that's the, sort of, the kicker here, is the fact that, uh... You know what it is? Um, Bob Bluke has to go to um, Green, ha has to get to Mission Street M5 before Piner even gets the opportunity to. So if Piner has a lead in that, it's going to be really tough. Right? A box like some, going into story. Yeah, Box is going into story. Seeing this cutscene again, it is 9 10, but it's about to be, it's really about to be 12 9 right now. 912, I should say. Um, uh, Lexi? Lexi? Okay, here we go. Dream oh, skip. Any dream skippers? <laughs> you know what I say? This is the skip of dreams right here. 
Oh, you know what might be tough, actually? Um, Piner has to get the B rank, so that's going to slow them down quite a bit, quite substantially. So I think if Piner can get a clean A rank here, um, they could, in theory, um, beat Piner to this hidden base mission, and then it's just emblems, right? Do you think? Yeah. It would just be emblems after that. So if Piner ends up getting an A rank here and having to redo it, mm -hmm. um, this could be like huge for uh, Blug. And by the way, this B rank is kind of, it's kind of tough. It's very tough because the way that the game developers made this game is like uh, they expect you to not know where anything is. So the time bonus is like crazy. Yeah, it's, it's just very easy. Yeah, it's very easy to get an A rank, but a B rank, on the other hand, you gotta go out of your way to get these monitors. Meanwhile, Blug is coming through to the very end here. Um, yeah, she just needs to secure the A. Um, oh my god. Oh, uh, that was stressful. <laughs> <Did you? laughs> Alright, I'm glad I'm not the oh, only one. Oh, no, no, okay, okay. Yeah, oh my god, oh my god. Get up there, get up there, get up there! Ah! Mom, hold me, I'm scared. Oh god, oh god. Oh my god. Okay, getting the awesome. Okay, so this should be the A rank, and I mean, you gotta give it up, right? This. Oh my god, Lexi, don't die. But um... Did they get the B rank? No, they did not get the B rank. This is exactly what Blue needs. Okay, so this is interesting. Um, so if Blue like, goes into Death but... Chamber right now, though... No. Right? But Blue doesn't have access to Death Chamber. Oh, you're right. Blue, oh, but so she's Blue just going is back wasting and... a bunch of time. And yeah, Blue, Blue does really needs know. to go into hidden mission. Oh no. Yeah, so this is kind of like Piner can spend as many hours as he wants in this mission. It's not going to matter because Blue is going to try to beat them to it anyway. Yeah, Blue really needed to go into hidden base like first and just get those missions. Not hidden base, uh, mission street. Yeah, and I mean, I think it's really interesting that Fox. If I were Box personally, I would be grinding the heck out of that one. Yeah, me too. Because Cause that, cause that's what they need. But but here's the thing, right? If I'm Box, there's no, there's not a snowball's chance in heck that Lexi is not in Cosmic Wall right now. Like, or else, what else was Lexi doing? I could have sniped Lexi at all these things. Lexi must be in Cosmic Wall, so I'm gonna go ahead and get the emblem, sort of thing, and I'm not gonna spend two minutes in Route 280. Right, but like it's pretty unfortunate how this thing is gonna go right now. Like this B rank is pretty devious, but oh my god, Devo, this is I don't know what to think about this. Yeah. I mean I saw Blue practicing it like right before um the match, but I I don't think that Blue uh is gonna be able to get it before Piner. So um so, yeah, I don't know. It's it's crazy to think what this match could be like right now if Blue just decided to go straight into Hidden Base. Because, like, you could really right. see, like, an, an 80 emblems, like, finish here. Oh, I know. I know why. I know why. No, Mission Street. Mission Street. I was uh, about to say. If that's it, right. If it, I keep saying Hidden Base. Mission Street. If it was, if it was, if it, if it, if it was a Mission, if it was Hidden Base, then it would be a Steven Davis. And it, it was like, all right. He's like, all right, let me not let me not go because I'll be wasting my time. But I mean, Box is going to figure out very soon that Lexi's going to get this goal and they're going to be in the lead again instead of tied. So I mean, oh, you know what? It's about to be twelve. So if they really want to, if they really want to um, guarantee the victory, they go for oh, Piner. Can we? No, like there's no shot. Like Piner, no matter what, Piner has this because Blue is just. You saw that Devo, right? I did, yes. Yeah. Because Piner can mess this up to his to to their heart's content. Well, but only mess it up as many times as until Blue could get it um before Piner somehow. Um cuz if if Piner messes this up like another two or three times, you know, Blue was practicing it before the match. So it's very possible that she could get it first try after. Yeah, so Box, I'm surprised that you're doing what you're doing, but... Sky really does give you access Wait to a, a bunch of fast missions. No, no, I just realized what... 
I'm very stupid. I just realized. Um, Blue is doing this to get to Eternal Engine, actually. Uh, oh. So, Blue, I, I think that Blue probably knows that, um, that Piner's having trouble here. Oh! No, Blue. Blue could have went over and dr drill dived again. That's All okay. All right, so I think we're going to see Box Grind missions here as well. So, yeah, yeah they're box, both in Dry Lagoon. So all eyes are off the dark runners right now. Their jobs are done. Um, yeah, this is really going to come down to. Uh, yeah, yeah, but doesn't. But if Piner secures uh, Death Chamber M two and uh, Mission Street yeah. M five, then that's it, right? Here's the thing. Here's it's so interesting that you said that because um, if if you're Piner, you have to do a coin flip. Do you think Box? Do you think Blue is in Mission Street? Or do you think Blue is going for chat, going for Eternal Engine? And I would think that Blue is in Mission Street, right? Because that's oh, the I guess mission. you're right. Yeah, yeah. So, so, so right now it's all going to and and by the way, this is taking Piner forever, but not not to any of their like ghost. Not oh my god, this is the worst. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Anyways, um, <laughs> the the piece is right there, and they have to get like many hints and. It's just really annoying, but um, anyways, um, so pi if you're Piney, you have to do a coin flip. You, I, you either got to say, okay, um, do I gamble for, wait a second, what happened to Mission Street? Okay, never mind. Yeah, so, oh my god, oh my god, Blue, you cannot choke this KBB right now. Like, blue, this is this is a blue gold mine right now, Devo. Yeah, I but, agree. But Blue it might mess up, okay, good, good. Okay, yeah, if Piner. If Blue gets this Eternal Engine and the Mission Street somehow because Piner oh! thinks oh, that's another A rank. Oh my god, Piner's probably fuming right now. Okay, this is what tilts Piner, I will tell you. I mean, all right, Blue, good on you because I thought you were going to go into Death Chamber. Here, all right, so here's the thing, Debo. If your name is Blue 4 and you're playing a bingo match right now, you've got to think that Piner is in. I don't Piner, even know. Piner, I thought that Piner was gonna go out story. for a second. Yeah, me too. I thought the same thing. And I, I wouldn't blame them at all, right? But I mean, I think Blue is making the right decision here. But uh, uh, this okay, is such, there we go. This is, this is such a disaster on both ends. Oh my goodness! And this is a really fast um thing, by the way. So, so it's all on Blue right now. Blue. Must, and I mean must, get both goals. Blue must get Eternal Engine and finish. Blue must, um... Oh my god, Piner's at the beginning. Wait, Blue's exiting? Alright, Blue, are you gonna go for Mission Street? No, Blue... Uh, Blue's getting the, uh, Blue's getting the upgrade. No, Blue's getting... Blue's going to Death Chamber. So, uh... Oh, man, this is... GG's, I guess, but... I don't know if somehow know. if somehow Blug secures this mission before Piner, which I would be shocked about. The, but here's the thing: it's still good because let's say if Piner does get this mission and Piner goes into Eternal Engine, they don't have it unlocked yet. So if 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 Lexi, for example, like gets it, if you if you see what I'm saying, right? Yeah. If Lexi gets that Eternal Engine, then it's a race for um. For a thing for a hidden mission street and missions, of course, but yeah, I mean, I understand where Blue's coming from. Eternal Engine's a really long stage, and like sinking yourself into that mission could be difficult. But I mean, like, ah, uh, if only she could see what we're seeing. <laughs> yeah, it's a case of like we know what the best play is, and it's really painful that the other people don't know. So Piner, like, you've got to wait, my friend. You have to get hints, and you've got to wait. I know it's tough, but... Yeah, Lex... Blue is just gonna be destroyed. I mean, all things considered, right? Blue is not wasting that much time. Like, in general. But it is time that she absolutely needs, and I think this is gonna be the, the death knell here. Yeah, I mean, it's like, it's definitely like, if she, let's say she was like doing Eternal Engine right now, it'd be time, like, better spent. Yeah. Um, 
Yeah, look, at, look mean, at Piner. I, Piner's chilling. Yeah, well, Piner at this point is probably just like, I have to wait out the clock. Um, at this point, I mean, honestly, would the play would have been to have just looked up what the time requirement was to get a B rank with only with no hints and just Devo, Devo, I just think, wait. I think I think I, I mentioned this to everyone, everybody. This B rank shenanigans are terrible. It's like, especially for like Meteor Herd, Mad Space, these kind of levels. Like, the the game developers did not expect you to clip through the walls and like do all this garbage. So. So yeah, this is going to be over pretty soon, and um, it, it's going to depend, right? Because Piner can get this mission, but yo, know, Piner, Piner, if Piner, Piner somehow Piner, gets a C, or if Piner somehow gets a C rank right now, I don't think Piner's getting a C rank. It, I don't think so. <laughs> bet? How much you want to bet? I'm uh, I'm I don't know. I, I'm not going to bet. How, but how, how, how many how many rings do you bet? How many Sonic rings do you bet? Here we go. I'll bet uh, 50. Here we go. Or 50 rings, enough to buy a triangle fruit. Are you, are you a triangle fruit fan? One triangle fruit. Here we go. Let's see it. All right, there it is. That's the B rank. Oh, blue. One triangle fruit for you. All right. So, and what sucks is blue just finished the mission, which means now yeah. she has to wait for this. However, look at this. Piner is going into KBB. No, just... no. I, if I'm blue, there's no shot I'm not going into E. Right? Because you don't think that Piner has this unlocked yet. Never mind. Now nah, Blue's going for Mission Street, so... Blue, let Blue you gotta think this through, I mean... So, I... What's, so what happens here? If Blue gets... So Pi, Blue has to get both of these to, to for this to go yeah. to 80 emblems, right? Yep, and Blue is doing something... They're, they're deviating, so... Unless Blue has a sudden change of heart somehow... Yeah, if Blue, if Blue does mission two and then just decides... All right, you know what? You got hit, Blue. Go back. You got hit, Blue. Go back. Go to EE. Oh. E. Go to EE. E. Blue gets a sign. The, the, the Sonic gods are giving you a sign. No. But yeah, it's tough to go out this way. I mean... Like, if... Like, this was such a good match either way. Like, regarding yeah, like, anything that Yeah, it was an unbelievably good match. But... Oh. It was just really, it, it was really like, I don't even have the words to say it anymore. It's just unfortunate. I don't know, maybe Luke finishes this M2 and just jumps into EE. You think so? I don't think so, but I, I'm you hoping think, uh, so. You think, um, you think, uh, she's got a bug in her, her, her ear? She's got so, an insider saying, Go, go into E, go into E. Because, like, it just makes sense, right? Because for, for those who may be in the chat right now, like, we know, we know for a fact that Piner does not have access to space right now. So I don't know why why Blue would do this necessarily. Like, we maybe to mix, maybe but, to mix you them gotta, up. But... You gotta think about how long it took Piner to get the, the uh, Death Chamber, uh, B rank. Blue mm. could probably think that Piner wasn't story for a while of that. You know what I mean? Yeah. So maybe Blue thinks that Piner exited EE e e as well. So yeah, but there's the there's a turn on sure. So I mean, Piner is very good at um, all the EE e skips. So I mean, I don't expect P like this is very consistent. I don't ex expect Piner to. Like take any prisoners here. I think it's just. I think they're just gonna take this one to the bank right now. It's just so close. They were final rush was just so close to a victory, but just very much falling flat during just some some decisions at the very end. You're absolutely right from what you said at the very beginning, Devo. Yeah, uh, it's just um, it's just crazy. I mean, uh, you really got to hand it to Blue and Box here. They really held it together for so much of this and uh and you know a lot of these are just like little execution mistakes away from wins you know so this is it just gets uh it's just I mean, crazy just think, about, think about think about the egg quarters think about the the death chambers like uh, uh, on the decision to go to jeff chamber the decision to go to mission street 
Yeah. Like all of these things. Oh, blue safes. Oh my god. Blue safes. <laughs> Box and with the blue, blue safes. Safe fans. Oh my god. Anyways, Piner's rolling up to the gold ring right now. See that chow box right there? Very much incognito. But they did get it. They got it. Alright, so <laughs> how many rings does Piner have now? We have our... Is that like they got, 40 something? They got the, it's chow boxes, they're good. Oh, they it's chow boxes, not rings. Okay, and there's the yes. e-skip. Yep, it's GG. Piner doesn't miss these. Alright, it's about to be time. Let's see how it goes. We have... Man, E skip is so much longer. This is a really, like... This is a really consistent way to do it. Piner's not messing around here, and they're just kind of vibing basically but um like this is very consistent like with the other one you have to like like go around but it's gg right now um, that is gg i wonder if these runners want to go in for an interview but i definitely wouldn't blame them Stage select. yeah lexi's not going for an interview blue and box are going for interviews let's see if piner all right piner yeah piner's coming in lexi we're we're gonna do everything for Lexi right here because All Lexi. Right, so... oh. Okay. All right. So G uh, GG's everyone. GGs. That yeah, was such was, an amazing what an amazing, game. amazing race. And that guys, I know, match. I know, I know, like emotions must be running high right now regarding what happened, but it happened to literally every single one of you, and I want you to know that so you are yeah. not alone. Yeah, yeah. Not one person. Not one person had like a point where there wasn't like that they didn't make some crazy mistakes. So you guys, none of you guys should feel bad about anything. So yeah, yeah I do want to say actually, go, I, I am pretty ahead, mad. Ahead, so so there were three goals um, that if mm -hmm. I didn't completely just blunder, mm -hmm. I, I definitely would have gotten. So the first yep. one is Wild Canyon M1 Hintless, which I accidentally read a hint at first, and then I had yeah. to restart, and then yeah. I got. A really terrible set for Hintless. I got like above the head or something, and then oh, yeah. I got um, Wild Canyon track piece too, and then I got a free piece that I didn't spot, and it was really annoying. Yeah, uh, I, got, I, yeah, I had a 56 Hintless in Wild Canyon. <laughs> yeah, I had a 46 after restart. I gotta uh, say, the, the one of the biggest turning points this entire match was Sand Ocean. Yeah. Uh, like so, 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 Lexi had a lot of trouble with Sand Ocean, which I'm not gonna really get too much into. But mm -hmm. uh, but Box gets first try sandwalking, and then the robot kills itself, and yeah, Box has awesome. to like reset, and it just wasn't fair, and like it was just it was un it was unbelievably sad. Yeah, Box. Was, like how? But Box, like here's the thing, like how did you feel afterwards? Like you got the flame ring, like, and you, at that point you were ahead. Um, like that was such a crazy moment. I, was... I don't know very confused because i i guess in my head i was just expecting that lexi didn't also have a sand ocean moment yeah yeah and lexi then... ended up gaming over twice which uh lexi and i both very uncharacteristically missed yeah. the skips that we're really good at yep yep piner props to you for getting second try city escape skip by the way you ended up being ahead of blue oh, i'm just so you know and um, oh, awesome. and I mean, box that egg quarters. Oh my god! Like, like basically everything that happened there. Like, I, I definitely feel for you, and I know that you're gonna be in the lab, like, just to just to get those those things down with the hitless. Um, but you were like ahead for for a good portion of it, though. Yeah. In my defense, I was getting pieces like. <laughs> so I'm not in the stream. Yeah, no you one get, gets you, those people. You, you were getting like P, like so. Uh, your first one is kind of like not excusable because two beautiful fish women is something you could see in story style. But yeah, you, but you did get rolled on P three of the second time you went through, because like yeah. nobody gets floating in the stream P three. That just doesn't happen. 
Yeah, I mean, unless you like grind for Centurion or X25s, like. Yeah, you, you just wouldn't... don't see it. You just no. don't see it. Now, during the end, like, Blue Guy, I want to let you know, like, mm -hmm. like, it was you, you guys still could have won, like, to the very yeah. end. Oh, man. So, the so, so basically, let me, let me break this down. Yeah, Piner, Melton stopped this. Piner, I'm sorry about what happened. Um, I've literally wasted 10 minutes in Death Chamber. Over 10 minutes. Oh, like 15 God. Minutes. Wow. Yeah, so I wasted like 15 I, minutes in Death Chamber. It was awful. I got like a four minute M2, and then I got an A rank three times in M4. And oh my God. I didn't realize yeah. that the point requirement is 10K. You oh have to on top of the third piece for an entire minute and a half. I, I, I finished the stage at 3.30, and I clearly got the B rank. I <laughs> went three nice. hits on every piece. So anyway. Piner, I was talking about it. Like, the, the game developers, like, they really underestimate the players, my guy. Like, they were expecting you to, be, like, pick your nose and just go around <laughs> the stage or something. I don't know. But... So here, the the crucial part was though, Piner Blue went into Death Chamber and decided to go out of Eternal Engine, um, at the mm -hmm. very end and just basically just checkerboarded you the entire uh, round. So, Piner, you got that Eternal Engine. Blue, if Blue went for that instead of like the other thing, it would have been totally different. Yeah, yeah. yeah. If Blue, if Blue had gone for Eternal Engine, then Mission Street. It would, so, it, we could totally be looking at a different. My, my uh, thought process we, was you guys would still be playing. <laughs> I didn't have the Mystic Melody, and I knew Piner did. So I was I was thinking that that they would go for Mission Street and Five because it, um, you know, Mission Street is way faster with the upgrade. Yeah. Uh, and I just wasn't thinking. I mean, obviously M Five is is really tough uh, in Mission Street, so not a lot of people like want to do it. But I figured that it's. Yeah, you know, if I were Piner, I would be thinking, you know, this is a safe goal, probably uncontested. I'm mm -hmm. guaranteed to be faster on it, so might as well just go for it. So I was thinking, you know, I should I should contest that. That's not a bad so, train of thought. I didn't think about that. And I mean, like well, you gotta and, and, and my go defense ahead, for Bloog was um because Piner took so long to do the death chamber. Like, what does Blue think Piner's doing? You know, oh, all yeah. this time, I, I thought Piner like, all was this, in Mission like, Street like the like, whole all, time. All, all, the, all this time's passing. Of course, Blue thinks that Piner's doing Mission Street, you know, because, like, um, um, so it's just this, like, um, so it is, like, sort of like a crazy sort of, like, Blue really had to, like, get lucky with her decision with there. I don't blame her at all for her decision. Yeah, that was, that was, like, that was a pure essence of a coin flip. And I, like, if the coin flipped a different way, like we could have still been going to AD emblems, but like you guys put up such a good fight and just I wanna I wanna like stress everybody's mental fortitude in this match in particular because I know it must not have been like it's not easy for anybody. No one's gonna like stand around for three minutes in death chamber and be like, look at your watch. So GG's all around. Like I cannot give you guys enough credit. Yeah, you guys also, all played so well. And also, Piner, you get to pick the raid. So, oh, um, cool. Um, also, I did want to mention yeah. that uh, uh, my thought process, by the way, Blue, was that there was no way that you, as a person, would go to Eternal Engine when you have Green Forest M5 and Mission Street M5. Like, mm -hmm. I didn't see you beating two bosses to go to Eternal Engine to get a single goal. Like, oh. I didn't see that as... Because I know how much you love to just jump out of story. Mm-hmm. Um, speaking of that, actually, I was curious, did I snipe you on Hidden Base M2 and Pumpkin Hill M2 like I thought I did? No. Yeah, Blue, uh, you, Blue was you, at you, the you, end of Hidden Base M2 whenever yeah. you did it, Hidden you, Base you M2. You sniped me to Hidden Base M2, but you, I, I was just in story in Pumpkin Hill M2. In fact, you actually helped me because, uh, because you did, uh, Pumpkin Hill M2, I got story lead, which gave me, uh, like, comfortability to go all the way to Desert. Piner. Oh, okay. Piner, do you know about Megamind, the movie? Oh yeah, dude. Piner's hidden base M2 was such big brain. Oh my god. So Piner, I, you are you're literally Mega Mind. I'm gonna call you Mega Mind from now on because getting the checkpoint, true. going back, dying, and teleporting to the front so you don't lose any time is just like I Oh yeah, the for the mystic more. melody mission, not M2. Sorry about that. Like yeah. like I I know like you you barely sniped Bloop to it. Like she was about to get it, but. 
then I saw you die, and I'm like, oh my god, this is really bad. And then you teleported <laughs> forward, and my mind was blown. <laughs> did, did you yeah, grind? Yeah, because you, you, you can't get out of there without uh, the, uh, what's it called? Uh, well, you can get out of there with the Mystic Melody. But, oh, but clearly, yeah, what yeah. you did was better. So, I, I actually... Oh, yeah. I actually kind of did the same thing. I got a checkpoint at the start of Hidden Base. In fact, I was ahead. Uh, the The reason why I didn't get the goal was because I died three times trying to get to the Mystic Melody. Yeah, yeah literally all the time that I spent before this race was just practicing the Mystic Melody because it is Dude, awful. It's terrible. It is horrible. I hate that clip is so hard. Like, in my, in my first All Missions run, I spent eight minutes there doing that. Yeah, that makes I'm sense. You, guys, there is one simple trick. You may have seen this, like, in an ad or somewhere, but there is one simple trick to that to that thing. I'll teach you guys that in a second, but, like... I just want to point that out because it's like, oh my god. Stellar, uh, Stellar also has a really good video on it. Yeah, so what I like to do is I like to go out um, in that corner with like the on the top with the uh, the pipe that you can whistle. And then I like to hold up right, but a little bit more to the right. And that usually fixes the camera. And then I can just like stall my height and just go straight for it. That hold usually up, works, but sometimes so the camera doesn't get fixed and then you die. Oh, for well, sure, I mean, Piner. the camera, you can move the camera. No, it likes to get stuck behind the wall. Oh, Prider, Prider, yeah. Prider, I got you. So first of all, you can you can definitely pick a raid target, and then I'll show you. Yeah, uh, I, I'm gonna choose Hedera here. Yo, Hedera. Let's yeah, go. let's go. All right, guys. Well, we love Hedera here. Yeah, we do love Hedera. Stick around next week as we have um some really cool matches starting Friday. So until then, we're signing off. GGs, everybody. Wait, GGs. no, I gotta race later. Come on. Yeah, Wait, me you too. Gotta race. You gotta race. Whoa, 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 whoa! You guys, ra whoa, what? We're racing at nine o'clock tonight. tonight. Yeah, me, 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 and Seahawks and Piner and Lexi are all uh, bingoing tonight at nine o'clock. So it be hasn't there, been updated be square. on the, uh, the sheet. It's just oh tonight. well, I'm informed. I want to accommodate those for sure. Well, forget what I'm saying. Uh, stick around, guys. Later tonight, we're not, we're not going anywhere. So yeah. Well, this is we're taking a break. We're raiding right now, and then we'll be yeah, back we're raiding. At 9 yeah. Yeah, we're, we're coming back at 9, but um, don't go anywhere, guys.